It's six o'clock in the morning, and Marty and I are aboard our Down East 38 sloop, Anita. We're leaving the Isthmus on Catalina Island, and we're going out to Santa Barbara Island, which is about 20 miles due west of Catalina Island. We're going by a 4th of July Cove there, and look at that, there's a group of people uh, up on the top of Lion's Head, uh, I guess kind of our farewell committee. That's Brad Avery's boat Galatea back in Howlands. We're going by Emerald Bay. You can see the fog is just hanging right over the mountains, very low. Lots of fog, it's now probably about 7 o'clock. You can see the sun is trying to come up, it's lighting up the mountainsides. Now that is the west end of Catalina Island. It's very barren. There's some rocks off the end. You want to give it a lot of clearance. That's me with the foghorn. We had to use the foghorn off and on to warn ships of our presence. As we got to Santa Barbara Island, it got even foggier, and we did not see the island until we were in 40 feet of water. Finally, the fog cleared, and this is what we saw. It's a very barren island, not very green. There was one other little boat out there. We anchored, and then we thought, well, what the heck? Let's see, maybe we can find a little better anchorage. Uh, the weather was very unstable. Normally, in the afternoon, it blows very hard from the west. And this is the east side, and this is a great anchorage. But we've had a lot of easterly wind, a lot of southwesterly wind. So we sort of have our fingers crossed. Well, we didn't exactly luck out. The wind went uh, to the east in the morning. It made the anchorage we were in really not very comfortable. So we had one really nice afternoon out there, and I did not, uh, I thought we could go over to the west side, but there was a great big westerly swell breaking. So we saw, said, what the heck, let's go back to Catalina. So really this was like a 24 hour turnaround. We fished all the way out, and uh, we only got one hook up, but the line broke. It looked like a nice sized sea bass. That's Catalina now. It's been really lumpy coming back because there's been a westerly swell, there's been an easterly swell, and then there's a storm or a hurricane down in Mexico. So then there's a great big ground swell. That's Catalina. We're going to be very happy to uh, get into a smooth harbor. That's a big persainer. Actually, this was about where we got the hookup on a fish. This big persainer came in, wrapped his net, and uh, probably going to go away with a couple tons of uh, tuna or something like that. This is the entrance to Catalina Harbor, and we've been out there bouncing around for seven or eight hours, and we are really excited to come on in and have it be nice and smooth. This is one of our favorite anchorages on Catalina Island. So I hope you enjoyed this little video.